There are a number of ways you can use the word pesado or heavy, literally, in Mexico. Today we're gonna look at two main ways that you can use that word. So one way you can use the word pesado or heavy is when it's something that requires a lot of effort. Uh, for example, if you have a really difficult hike, you could say, es una subida bien pesada. The same word actually applies to people who require a lot of effort. So somebody who has like an overly strong personality or who is just really hard for you to get along with, you might say, esa persona es bien pesada. Ese morro es bien pesado heavy to deal with. And another use of the word that's super common is when you want to say that somebody is really good at something. You say, esa persona está pesado para, pesada para. So if somebody's really good at soccer, ese morro está bien pesado para el fútbol. Or a kid is like a ping pong prodigy. No manches, ese niño es bien pesado para el ping pong. So that's two really common ways that you can use the word pesado, which literally translated would be heavy. When somebody or something requires a lot of effort, and when somebody is really good at something. These uses of the word pesado, I would give them a 75% likely to hear and an 85% safe to use. Not really a lot of ways that you could mess this one up. <laughs> Hope that was helpful for you. See you in the next video when we're gonna be talking about sangron.